forgive me youtube for giving you the worst intro ever but wagwan guys i was in soho the other day and i just decided to you know what record i am by canal street which means i am by the infamous stadium goods now if you guys are in the soho area you're gonna go by howard and broadway and you're gonna walk down this block right here and there you have it stadium goods As soon as you walk into the stadium because you are greeted by their employees when you look at your left side you're going to see a wall that says spring in your step this is all their spring shoes that they are rocking now this right here is your jordan wall everybody used to love jordan ones and this is all the jordans they had to offer crazy amount of jordans but i'm gonna look at the jordan ones i know you guys don't care for these anymore but i still have a love for jordan ones because they're so casual and easy to wear the sea foams i still want these i don't like anymore then you have the tiana taylors now these right here is crazy However, your boy Squint is not a fan. I don't really like these. They, they have so many Jordan 1s to offer. I'm not going to hold you. I regret not getting these mochas right here. And maybe one day I'll pick them up. One thing about stadium goods that they're going to have everything organized. Now, this wall is known as the dunks for days because they literally have dunks for days. Now, these caught my eye because I still want them. These are the Ambush Dunk Highs. They are so fire, and yes, they will be in the collection one day. They have both colorways because these are also amazing. Now, this right here shot me the Supreme Dunk Highs in my hand. This is normally in trophy cases, but they have it out, and I'm happy to finally see it. Maybe I need it. Goddamn is my size. Maybe that's a sign. What do y'all think? Should I cop these right here? Let me know. I'm not going to hold you. I think they have all the lot dunks, but if they don't, they probably have the most that I've ever seen. Of course, the black ones that everybody love. Not really a fan, but you know, there's a few that I want. But here's what really caught my eye when it comes to the regular dunks and not the SBs. The year of the rabbit. When did these drop? Because I've never seen them on the sneakers app. <sighs> I think the price of those are out my range right now, but they're still nice. like another thing that stadium goods have over all these other competitors is that their merch is actually cool this is some stadium good shorts i think these are fire the green ones i might come back and cop because i heard they're on sale but your regular mesh shorts i think these are fire they also have you know socks like everybody else shorts shirts but their socks collection crazy now here we have the versatility wall which is you know other brands adidas new balance your bape sacconis or sockonis whatever you want these has their own wall it's in the back but yeah those sean witherspoons are coming home very soon but you know new balance having a wall still has me shocked now i did say that these were trash but they're actually growing on me do you guys think i should use my flip-flop card and buy these y'all let me know because i think this red colorway is pretty clean another pair of alds that i want the 550s i really think these are clean but i'm not spending that bread so let's put them right back up there so you guys watch all the sneaker shop away complex this is where they go stadium goods this is the trophy case let's take a close look because they have some bangers in this right here looking at it god damn you have your cause doll with the cause fours they just playing with me right here because I need those. Then you got the friends and family, the samples. Do you see that price tag? Yeah, I will be window shopping. Except for those. Those UNC's off-white coming home one day. Those are fire. I forgot the name of them. The Doom Dunks. Then you got your PEs. I don't do PEs, but those right there, clean. You got your trophy rooms, of course. Then you got your off-white Chicago's. People love those. I love the fact that they have this uh, trophy room, you know, more themed out. I feel like everything is together. A lot of people hate those shoes, but they are fire. Don't care what nobody say. And then you have the Louis V's, the Money Man shoe cost thirteen thousand dollar. Boom! But fair pair of shoes is crazy. But those bad boys, those mids, fire.
since we're talking about fire these are the galaxy forms who is ready for the galaxy rebirth and i hope nike basketball come back together and if you guys didn't know air forces used to be basketball shoes that's why they're in this section right here the who got next section because you know basketball who got next next game yeah anyway these claw air force are coming home i don't care how much they cost i'm buying them one day next to these bad boys i need those I'm not gonna lie to you when you think of stadium goods merch you gotta think about their jackets because those jackets right here are definitely fire their t-shirts are kind of plain while well, the ones in the front is kind of plain their sweatpants their shorts is pretty cool too but i definitely wanted to try on that blue jacket thanks big shout out to the gentleman right here gonna make me try them on well we're gonna make me try that jacket on and look at me i look fire am i gonna lie for four beans for four hundred dollars i think i might pick these up i like them how does the fit look talk to me people but if you guys didn't know i actually came to stadium goods to pick these up i wasn't gonna record but i had to because these are fire j tip my huge do your thing these are coming home but first i gotta try them on let me slide in the piggies let me slide in the dogs and let me see how they look on feet oh my gosh i know a lot of you guys are saying that these shoes are too wild they're too crazy but that's type of my flow in the summertime these are if you guys haven't seen the top 10 summer uh, sneaker video please go check that out these are fire i like these they are coming home the shoes is secured and there you have it guys that was stadium goods i'm not gonna lie to you guys all i could say about stadium goods right now is wow when i say wow i mean wow because there's no way i could walk into a resale shop i'm talking about a store that sells stuff for the aftermarket price and i'm picking up a hyped up shoe a collab for retail let me let me read this off to you i got these shoes for retail the retail was 150 i paid taxes of course which means these came out to 163 bro god crumple up the receipt because i can't return them anyway but son these shoes right here is amazing but let's talk about the experience that i got first from this store right here mr stadium goods well i'm not gonna hold you i'm not gonna lie my experience walking through those doors was amazing now i was greeted by the security outside and then i was greeted by the three employees that were standing in the front talking as soon as i walked in they saw me recording did not disturb me did not say don't record because you know in some boutiques you can't record where it sucks because that's free you know advertisement but anyway they said hi how you doing they let me record i was walking around did my thing but the customer service is on a top notch level when i walked over to the back of the store just to, you know see what they have i looked at the socks i looked at the shorts another employee came over and he was like hi how you doing i see you touching the shorts just a heads up they're on sale he never had to tell me that yes they might be trying to make a commission sign because they get paid by commission who knows but it doesn't matter they told me the information anyway and then i chopped it up with a few of them and i asked them like hey your trophy room looks kind of different explain to me the layout and they had no problem explaining it the customer service in that store i'm giving it a five out of five when, when it comes to the layout and the design of the store is your typical resale shop with the shoes lined up but the way they did it was better because every wall had a plaque that told you what the shoes were if it was basketball if it was dunks if it was yeezys if it was uh air jordans they had it all sectioned off and you know that's what i love i love to walk into a store and everything is organized i know where everything is at so when it comes to the dunks i think the plaque said hey dunks all day when it comes to jordan it said of course air jordan and then when it comes to the new balance and other stuff it said uh something about being versatile and that we had other stuff which is amazing too because you could just walk into a shop and it tells you where everything is is great unlike certain shops you got to look around figure stuff out like oh all the jordans are there oh all this is there just by looking i think that was pre me um and i'm gonna give them another five out of five for the layout when it comes to the pricing it's stadium goods what do you expect for that i gotta give them a three now when it comes to pricing when you're going to stadium because this is not your regular degular resale shop this is not your mom and pop resale shop either this is a well-known top shop when it comes to reselling everybody know flight club 
stadium goods. That's the two heads that everybody know. And I'm have to say the price is justifiable. Uh, celebrities go through there. Uh, diplomats go through there. So they price got to be somewhat premium. But at the same time, you can find some steals in there. And I feel like I'm going to do another video where you can find steals at resale shops. And we're going to see what I can find. But that's another video for another day. One thing I'll say Stadium Goods have over Flight Club is their merch. Their merch is way better. And I want to say it's not just a plain t-shirt or a plain sweater that says Stadium goods i feel like they actually put effort into their merch they have some shorts that i might go back for like i said they were on sale the shorts are pretty cool too and for 15 dollars you can't go wrong the socks are socks so they say stadium goods that's okay i guess but they're 15 dollars, so i might not pick those up but then stadium goods for me and their apparel is known for their varsity jackets their varsity jackets may cost between three to six hundred dollars but they are worth it bro i tried on this blue one right here do you see how nice I look bread I'm on these are fine and for a resource shop to have a nice I uh, want to say a power or merch line it's pretty cool too yes I want them to step it up a bit but I can't go wrong and this is why I'm gonna give that store a five out of five overall I'm giving them a five out of five they have bright lights and the wall is white which means you can see all the color on the shoe while you're looking at it one thing I would say that I have to give them a clap for the same way that I gave soul stage a clap for because they switched out their uh their trophy room there's a lot of shoes that's high level that's not in their trophy room in in their trophy room you're gonna get the rarest of rarest and the most exclusive of exclusive stuff because that's their trophies we have it they don't that's what a trophy room is but if other stores have like the galaxy foams a supreme dunk why should i put it in there it's not it's, it's not a crazy rare shoe because every resale shop has it right so that's why i was able to have and that's why i was able to hold the galaxy foams in my hands the supreme dunks which yo I saw the price tag of the Supreme Dunks. Well, not the price tag, the size tag. It was in my size. And just because I had it in my hand, now I'm thinking, Squin, you should pick those up. But maybe one day. But that's it, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. That store overall is pretty great. And if you guys are in the Soho area, please go check it out. You're going to enjoy yourself. And you might walk out with something. You could ask them if they have anything for retail and they might just look it up. I'm just happy that after this review, I could walk out with a shoe and actually show you guys. Because that's what I want to do. I want to go to all these shops and actually buy something. Not just go in there, do a little B-roll, and then go home. I think interacting with the employees there is going to make me have a better understanding of that store's culture. That way, it can help me with my review and help guide you guys into the right direction of which stores you could visit because which stores actually have that premium service this store is one of them i have another store in mind that i want to go check out and i can't wait for you guys to see it but until then love manas and always respect i'm out of here